Hello everyone, so this is about Square Cafe on the East End in Pittsburgh. Mm -hmm. So we went in there, look at all the balloons. I yeah. like the way it was decorated. <laughs> yeah, square, but lots of circles. Yeah, and it, <laughs> it's a really big open space, mm -hmm. so it's a little bit noisy. We were there before 10 o'clock. We got there at 9.30. I would highly recommend doing that on a Sunday because yeah, yeah. at 10 o'clock there was a line out the door. Yeah. But it's clean. It's nice. It's, it's got these plush little booths. Mm -hmm. Like we got sat in this booth. Man, that was like a, a leather recliner almost, like kind of uh -huh. level of comfort. And then um, this menu, you know, mm -hmm. they do they do actually have alcohol there if you yeah. want it. But like who needs that? Especially when you got pancake syrup. Mm -hmm. So... Yeah, they have it. It's really nice. Like, um, lots of wood over to, uh, tones. There's a big picture window up front, but they did put shades down when it got sunny. Mm -hmm. And they got this huge menu. Tons of vegan choices. Uh, but they have their standard breakfast fare. Yeah. The you food, got The food was good, um, and it was decently priced. I got salmon benedict. So poached eggs, hollandaise sauce. Yeah, I saw that most of the things were like under 15 bucks. I don't know about that. Mine was that, 22. Yeah, that's probably the deluxe like yeah. thing on the menu. It's the uh -huh. filet mignon of the menu. Yeah, so it was it, good. Yeah. It was really good though. It was well made. You can see here's all the vegan options. Mm -hmm. So for your vegan friends, they're there. I tried uh, vegan mm -hmm. um, breakfast. I had vegan eggs for the first time. Yeah, they tasted kind of strange. Especially to us. next to like, mm -hmm. like, eggs mm -hmm. with hollandaise sauce on them. I mean, <laughs> my God, that was so good. Uh -huh. But yeah, they have pancakes. They've got um, uh, waffles. They got all kinds of stuff. They've mm -hmm. got sandwiches. They have salads. So mm -hmm. like, they're open till three o'clock in the afternoon. Mm -hmm. So they have uh, lunches, but not on Tuesdays. Mm -hmm. And I need something on Tuesdays. So mm -hmm. anyway, you can slow down the uh, video here and look at the menu if you need to. But, um, yeah, and they have all these, like, they have a coffee bar. Mm -hmm. So they have all these different lattes and hot mm -hmm. chocolate and teas and all that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. So uh, I ordered the um, special latte of the day, which was this uh, lavender honey. Mm -hmm. was like, whoa, that was really different uh, tasting. Yeah, I yeah. liked it because it, it wasn't dumpy. It's not a chain. Mm-hmm. It's not a chain, it's just one person, one, a business, a single business. Yeah, but they've been open for 20 years. Yeah, and she's, she's gone through a lot, because yeah. I've known her for... So here's the latte described yeah. there that I had. I've known the owner of this business, not super close, but mm -hmm. I've known of her. She's been to a lot of my other places so There's a 16-ounce latte. And it was really good. And then they had the specials up on a board behind the mm -hmm. counter. Mm -hmm. And uh, here's my... This is my vegan breakfast right mm -hmm. here. So you got the fake eggs, mm -hmm. you got the, the veggie sausage, which actually was really good. This uh, pancakes, no eggs, was made out of peanut butter, which gave it some interesting flavor. Ah. And then berries on top. And then here's Tara's salmon uh, with, um, yeah, Benedict. eggs Benedict. Mm -hmm. Now, parking is kind of a challenge, though. On Sunday, it wasn't too bad because we were there oh. early, but there's this giant church here. There's not a ton of on-street parking. There's none right in front. You have to park around the back. And then when we did go back to our car, we were kind of parked in. So just be aware, like, you know, parking on this side of town is gets at a very, premium. It gets very congested. And if you're out on a Friday or Saturday night, which we never do, uh, yeah. there's like chicken on the run. There's an oyster bar next door. There's yeah. like all kinds of neat stuff in this block. So if you yeah. are like on foot or if you Uber to the place, uh -huh. you've got options. Yeah. And, uh. Yeah, it's pretty cool. So we got there before the lion was out the door. There's the front of the store. All right. So I guess we'll leave it there. So uh, thanks for uh, joining us. And uh, thanks, everybody who's out there. 13,597 uh, subscribers now. So if you want to make that 13,600, go ahead and smash the subscribe button. And we'll see you guys on the next one. Take care. Yeah, it was really good. Yeah. We'll keep you posted on more restaurant reviews. We've been enjoying those. Okay.